Hey guys, welcome back to our Match Battlers video, and, well, yeah, I guess it could be Match Battlers, but today, um, a little interesting going on right here, but, um, uh, basically I had an idea for a TCG, it's not a new one, it's, the rules are, like, just like the one that you're, that, like, my last video was on, it was so similar to it. Uh, there's just like a little rule change, and then there's uh, actually no, there's a few really big rule changes, and then there's these. So it's pretty interesting. I I'll explain everything in a little bit, but um, first I'm gonna explain why this is out because I thought to myself, because I uh, me and my cousin we did this before. We made up our own TCG with uh, using playing cards. And it, it was kind of garbage. It was pretty bad. So I, so I thought to myself, like, making your own game or making up your own game with playing cards is so smart. If you want to just make your own cards, uh, you can do that. And then, because that's basically what I did. I made up a game with this, and then I made my own cards. But if you were to play my game, it would be a lot more easier if you got these than these because you don't use any of this but you don't really know how to play so i'm not going to go too in detail and go off course but you don't need this or that or anything but um basically so i thought to myself that i'll try to make i like try to make up another game using playing cards because it's smart don't have to make anything and you can just literally buy a full deck for like a dollar or two dollars so i did and the first time, it sucked. It was really bad. And then the second time, I was on something, and it was really good. And then I made a slight rule change. Or, no, I, I uh, got rid of something, and I added something. And the game's actually really good now. And I actually liked it so much that I just decided to... Sorry, the camera just shut off, but... I basically decided to just order blank playing cards... Um, I think it was, like, $10 for 180 and I only need, like, 54 or 55 so there was a much cheaper one, but I thought if I got so much more that I won't have to just, like, well, I, I can basically just use all the extra cards, because this is, uh, just one deck. I still have, like, these two left and then another one, so I can just use all those extra cards later on, so I thought it was pretty worth it. But, um, I'm basically just going to be showing you the deck. This is not the final deck. I know this does not look like a match battle or a yellow rectangle. But, um, I am going to be adding match battlers, except but these cards, you just, you can't make them too detailed because you can't really be very detailed with Sharpie markers. And these do not work one, well, well with pen. I tried it and it just smeared really badly, so... I'm just going to wait for the card stock to come in because it's like packaging cardboard. And then I'll just make cards and then... Yeah. So, there's nothing really special about this, but there's five copies of ones. So basically, in your deck, you have 35 one power cards and then you have... Uh, 15 two power cards, which is uh, back there. And you have four three power cards. So basically, what the powers are, are kind of just like the power of your people. So you, you would draw 10 cards in the beginning. And then... You would take the top card of your deck, let's just say it's this one, and that would be your starting card. But it's not like one, and then one, and then it goes like that. You can stack them, so then these, that would be a two, because it's two cards. And then a three, four, five, and you can keep on stacking like that. So that's mainly what makes the game even. Also, it uh, adds more strategy, makes it more fun. 
Yeah, that's, that's basically what happens. So then two people, two power people, they would add two instead of one. And then three power people add three. I did have knockout cards. Like, just destroyed a battler. These are the two guys. Or some of them. I didn't finish this yet. I only have, like, seven cards left, I think. But, um... We still have, like, knockout cards. And they'll just instantly kill a battler. But I decided to get rid of them and replace them with two more threes. Because there used to only be, like, one or two of them. So... Yeah. Yeah. And then here's the other ones that I did not finish with. But, um, so this deck is just a bunch of shapes. Honestly, this is the only thing that matters, is this number. And you can play using playing cards. So, actually, I don't really need to upload this to the Game Crafter at all. But if you guys, like, just want match battles or shapes, uh, just comment. I'll probably upload them to the Game Crafter anyway, the Match Battlers version. Like, the cards are just going to be full art with the name right down here and then a number in the corner. So, you know, like Pirate Card, Big Ring, classic ones. But basically, if you were to play with playing cards, the faces will be two. Everything that's not a face card would be one. The Jokers, I guess you can make them your threes because you have four of them. So you can make... The Jokers are threes. Now, this deck has three Jokers. But um, if you have two Jokers, which I think most decks have, you can make the Ace of Spades, because it looks different, one of your three powers. Make the two Jokers three powers, and then you can make one of the face cards another three power card. And that would actually be the same thing as if you got one of these decks, like a official deck i'm not really sure what i'm gonna call this game it's probably just gonna be called match battlers i don't know like battle cards i don't know some random something but um yeah that's basically how you would play with these because if you use two jokers and then the ace and then one of these you would have because there's 16 face cards in a deck i'm pretty sure so we'd have 15 faces, which is as much two people. So that's that's good. There's four four threes. That's good. And then there will be, I think, 36. Sorry, I just got a storage problem. I solved it, though. But I'm pretty sure there will be 36 one power cards. So if there is, uh, then just, I guess, get rid of one. So you can play with playing cards. But I might add a f like one five power battler to the deck, just kind of like for fun. And I mean, I might make the game better with that one five power guy. But I think I might do that. And then if I do that, I'm just gonna have to get one card for your five power guy. But you know. But um, I guess that's gonna have to be it for this video. Like, comment, and subscribe to see more. Uh, I just kind of wanted to do something different with the game because making a TCG off of, like, playing cards is so easy because, like, if you were to make cards and then make up, like, your own rules and then make all the cards, I know, I think some people, like, hand make all the cards and then they computer make all the cards and then they upload them to the Game Crafter. Like, I would love to do that, to upload it. But it just takes a while, and I actually don't know how to upload cards to the Game Crafter. So, it would just be like... And I, and I watch videos of how, and I, I just still can't figure it out. Like, the, uh... Like, I don't have... Like, I know you need, like, Photoshop. I don't have any, like, website that can help me to do that. So, I kind of just, like... When it says that you need, like, you know, like, Photoshop or something. I don't have any of that. And I don't, like, do anything on that. I don't understand those. So, it's like, I had this problem. And then I have this problem. So. Uh, so, if I just make a game. That's. You can play it with cards that are, like, $2. Then, like, from anywhere. 
then it, it would be completely fine. I mean, yeah, you guys might not be able, if I'm not able to upload it to the Game Crafter, you might not be able to get the Match Battlers cards, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Really just the number is the only thing that matters, and if they look cool, I mean, I guess I can try my best. But, uh, yeah, that's it. I, I'm also going to be doing probably lots of battle videos of this. Because there's nothing really much else I can actually do with this. Because, like, the cards are just so simple. It's not like they have abilities, so I can't, like, make a video based on three new cards, and it's pretty big. I would have to make a video in, like, a whole entire other deck. So... I mean, I did have another deck idea. This is called, like, Fireball. But then, I decided not to do it, but I might. But I'm not really sure if I will. But, there's probably gonna be a lot of battle videos. I wanna do, like, a, like a little mini tournament. Where we do, like, this deck versus, like, that deck. And then I can use, like, you know, like, these decks verse because playing cards work so and i have like a bunch of decks actually now these are like the only one decks that i have and then i would try to do like a three person battle like me and my cousin and someone else because i kind of think those battles are pretty cool i see like other people i think they play like magic doing that or like uh like other card games i think it's kind of cool to have multiple people play but i know some games you actually can't do that. Because then you can all team up and just like bomb one person and then they're out. But I think I got a solution. But Alright, this video is getting a little too long.